Now we're good? Yep. Okay. What's up, everybody? I'm Courtney. This is my sister, Katie. Hello. <laughs> um, so we thought today it would be fun to do, like, kind of a get to know you and eat with us. Kind yeah, of thing. so we like food and we like talking. So we're going to do both. And I think we're pretty good at both. I'm not. She's not. I'm pretty good at eating, clearly. And I'm pretty good at talking, probably clearly, because I'm the one talking the most. Um, These introductions are just weird. Yeah, introductions are weird. This is our first mukbang, so just bear with us. You can start eating. Um, so what I figured would be fun is I found, I went on the internet and I found a bunch of like weird questions to ask people, because I feel like those are pretty telling for being able to get to know someone. Mm -hmm. um, so I guess we'll start out with, um, I'm older, I'm 26, you're 24. I should tell them what we're eating. Oh, right. Okay. So what we got here is mac and cheese, mac and cheese, coleslaw, coleslaw, potato, taters, biscuits, biscuits. chicken, extra crispy chicken, extra crispy, chicken. extra crispy, and mac and cheese is a classic for our family because it's the only thing we eat basically, right? Uh, pretty much. Yeah. And um, it's KFC. And it's KFC. And we um, got some honey mustard sauce. Right. Barbecue, mm -hmm. sweet and tangy. tangy, and I've never had that from here. But I don't really, we don't really go to KFC a lot, so they also had a buffalo sauce, but I didn't get it. I found it scary to me. Let me see this. You sound scary to me. That <laughs> oh, kind of smells like Thai chili sauce. Ooh, I'm excited. <laughs> And barbecue, honey mustard. And then gravy, obviously, is we're going to dip the chicken in that, too, because why not? It sounds delicious. It sounds so good. Okay. <laughs> so, um, but anyway, like I was saying, I'm an older one. I'm 26. You're 24. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm 24. Mm -hmm. And there's six of us all together, siblings. Mm -hmm. And I'm the second oldest, but we have six siblings, and all of our names start with K. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Start eating. All right. You, I touched that one already. I don't know if you want it. I don't want it. Okay. Um, and it's Kyle is our older brother, and then me, Courtney, Katie, and then Cody, Connor, and Caden. So our parents did a really obnoxious thing. And they yeah, we're all, all we're all K's. I got some uh, sweet and tangy socks on here. And I'm going to dip it in the gravy because that sounds so good. Mmm. All right. That's really good. <laughs> mm. um, That's good too. Holy schmoly. That Thai sauce is good. Thai sauce. Sweet and tangy sauce is good? Yes. I'm gonna try that ah. before we get into these questions that I think are pretty fun. Oh my. I mean, tell me if they're not. Comment down below. <laughs> mm. Oh, that is really good. They also had a finger licking sauce, and in hindsight, I should have gotten that, because I've never had that before. What's that? I don't know. I wonder if it's like a Chick-fil-A sauce. Mm. It's like their signature. Mm. Next time. I'm sad that we only have two of these. Yeah, I didn't think we need more. You're talking about barbecue sauce. <laughs> Yeehaw, doggy! <laughs> okay, so. Uh -uh. That is so good. Pull up questions. You can keep eating. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. So, these are just random. They're not like, what's your favorite color? Although, that would be fun too. My favorite color is purple. <laughs> so is Jared's. There used to be. I haven't asked him since we first started dating and now we're married, so maybe it's changed. Um, That's an, unlike Jared. I don't know. I think so too. Um, so the first question I found is, da, 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 would you rather be fluent in all languages or be a master of every musical instrument? Oh, that is hard. Mm -hmm. I've always wanted to learn, should we do the bonies? You can just put them down here on top of all the lids. I don't always wanted to learn a musical instrument, but mm -hmm. I think it would be much cooler to be able to talk to people. Because then you can talk to anybody. Mm -hmm. I can travel anywhere. anywhere. Mm -hmm. 
My answer is the language one. That's my answer too. But I've always wanted to play the piano really well. Because I think people that play the piano are so cool. Mm. Do you guys want some mac and cheese with me? <laughs> you know those muffins where they're like, take the first bite. Here you go. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> um. Do you guys like coleslaw? No. That's all you. I don't know if I like regular coleslaw, but when I worked at the Ridge, mm -hmm. they had the best coleslaw. It was so good. Mm -hmm. It was like sweet. They had like apples and I'm cranberries. I'm saying like in. I ever had it. But did you know, coleslaw actually is yes. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how to word it. It's the. Oh gosh. If you're gonna get food poisoning, it's, it's from, be coleslaw? from coleslaw. That's scary. Yep. I mean, I don't it's eat it anyway, it, but. It's mayonnaise and it's. And, and it just sits out. Yeah, yeah, that's gross. But I like it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay, so. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse this you. question I like because our family really likes to watch cartoons. And I'm kind of putting my own spin on this question. So the question is, <clears throat> what cartoon do you still like to watch? But I'm going to change it to, what's your favorite cartoon that you're watching right now? Okay. I'm not watching cartoons right now because, well, I am. Because Mabel watches cartoons. Mm -hmm. But she only watches ones that there's music. Like the Johnny Johnny Yes Papa. Yeah. <laughs> um... Technically, I am, but the last cartoon I watched <clears throat> was Steven Universe. Mm -hmm. I finished that series. Oh, yeah, I remember when you were watching that. I like that one. And I like, I love Adventure Time. Mm -hmm. I just finished Adventure Time for the first time all the way through. It was so good. So good. The last season's I wild. watched it twice all the way through. You did? Mm -hmm. huh. Well, I watched it, I watched it twice through to the last season, mm -hmm. and then I watched only the last season once. Well, they they just barely put the last season on Hulu. It's so good. Like, um, but but our family also really liked Chowder <laughs> when it first came out. Was, they put all of that on Hulu. They did. They did. I don't think I have Hulu anymore. You have mine. I do. Mm -hmm. so. That is true. Yeehaw. Mm, what should I have next? I think a thaw is. What or should we have next? I had a wing. That's what I mean. Oh, wait. What is this? A wing. Uh-huh. Is this a wing? Mm hmm I'm having a wing. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> oh, mama. I also like anime. Ugh, I don't. Judge me, okay? And we do. <coughs> Excuse me. If you, Caitlin... Worked yes. at a circus. Which job would you want to have? Huh. Never thought about it before, huh? No, I have not. I want to be part of the freak show. Uh, hmm. I want to be the trapeze lady. Yeah, that'd be cool. But it. Scary. I probably wouldn't want to be part of the freak show, but. What would you, would you be like the bearded lady or what? <laughs> I could be. You, no, you know what you would be? You'd be, you know, a little rascals, and they go, The man eating chicken! <laughs> <laughs> and then, mm -hmm. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know. So, my next question for this one is, That's me. <laughs> if reincarnation exists, what would you like to come back as? Okay. Real quick before you start, I would like to come back as a smart person who could become a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> what? You have to reincarnate into an animal, don't nope, you? I don't know. I'm just saying, if reincarnation exists, the way that I would like to come back is as a smarty smarter person. Well, then I'd like to come back as a billionaire. Yeah. But what animal? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, animal. Ooh. That's a good question. Mm. I'd probably come back. Ooh, that's hard. 
Mm, I've always wanted to be a dog. <laughs> That's true. They live the life, man. Our aunt tells us a story that at her wedding, I don't know if she was like trying on her dress or what. This isn't true. Shout out to Aunt Kim. I think it's true. She felt something tugging on her dress and she looked down and Katie was naked rolling around in it. She told me that I peed on her dress, but I... That's a lie. I feel like that part's made up. Because <laughs> she probably would have murdered you. Yeah, can you imagine if I peed on her wedding dress? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I'd probably come back as a dog. Mm hmm Okay. So. This one's funny. I ain't gonna like this question. <laughs> if you could pick a new first name, what would you choose? <laughs> <laughs> First of all, tell everyone what you wanted to go by. Shut up. Nope. When I was little, I dressed as a boy. Mm hmm Until she was like 12. And I wanted everyone to call me BJ. Stick name, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but, what would you do? I don't know. I like, I don't love my name. But I don't meet a whole lot of Courtney's. Yeah. So. I know a lot of Katie's. There, I know of multiple Katie's, so. Especially in Utah. One of my best friends' name is Katie, besides her. I would probably change it to. I always loved the name Brielle. Yeah. I don't think I would ever name a child Brielle, though. She wanted to when we were in high school. <clears throat> I, would, I would probably change my name to something like Nora or June. I like old lady names, like Pearl. That's like the name I wanted to name my next, if I had a daughter, next. She already has a daughter. I have a daughter named Her name's Mabel. Mabel. I love Nora. What is your preferred weapon in a zombie apocalypse? Huh. Probably a gun. Because mm. I don't want to get too close. But then they'll hear the gun. Like, if we're going off of Walking Dead rules. True. Mine... If is. I was a badass, <laughs> then what's yours? Okay, you tell me yours. I would want a baseball bat, kind of like Negan, but I wanted this before Negan was a character in the show. Yeah, screw Negan! <laughs> a baseball bat or a 4x4, four four, like wood with nails sticking out of it. Oh my god. So you want to be Negan? <laughs> I wanted that before Negan yeah, was right. Negan. I don't believe it. Okay, whatever. I said that in high school. You don't remember me saying that? When did that ever come up in high school? What are you talking about? I just... So what would your... What would your weapon be since you're so smart and so cool and know everything about zombies? Hmm. Um... Probably, a uh, Chainsaw. That'd be cool. But it'd be loud. <coughs> Quit it. Sorry. You're right. It would be loud. Mm hmm Jeez. Probably then, um... Mine, right? No. Oh. It, if you use a bat, uh -huh. how many times is it going to take you to kill it? I don't know. It depends on if you can get their head in the first shot. Well... I feel like getting a head would be easy if you have a bat, right? Right. I played softball. <laughs> oh I was a catcher. <laughs> um, that's a hard question. Mm -hmm. You have to have something big. Mm -hmm. So you could get them easier. Something that would take them really off guard in the first swing. Yeah, a bat would be good. Mm-hmm. Maybe like a mace. Mm-hmm. That'd be cool. Mm-hmm. Or you could But like, that would be really hard to target them, you know? You could be like Michonne with the samurai sword. Oh, that'd be cool. Mm-hmm. Slice out their heads and mm -hmm. then just like leave them. Uh-huh. Sick. Yeah. <laughs> I could be a samurai. I'd say that. Okay. That's um, didn't know that. Yeah. Okay, next question. Here's this one I really like because I already know the answer. If you could max out your credit card at one store and not have to pay the bill, which would you choose? That's a good one. Target. Target for me. That's what first came to my Target. head. Mm -hmm. 
Well, because there's everything at Target. Mm-hmm. There's cute clothes. Mm-hmm. Electronics. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, probably, yeah, probably Target. This is really hard to eat. <laughs> like a fancy Walmart. It's the better Walmart. It's the fancy Walmart. Yeehaw. <laughs> Insane. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. Which bread do you think would fly furthest? <laughs> what? Non if you threw it like a frisbee. Okay. Or a baguette if you threw it like a javelin. <laughs> baguette. Yeah, I agree. Doi. Do okay. That's silly. <laughs> okay. This one's interesting. Okay. I, I think about this a lot. <laughs> do you? Yes. If you could get away with one crime, what would you do? Mmm. Rob a bank for mm -hmm. show. Mm -hmm. Or kill someone. Heck no. Oh, I would. There's a lot Who of would you kill? Oh, let's see. Where do I start? What? Are you serious? Yeah. You are a true crime fanatic. fanatic right? Yeah. And you would kill somebody. Bad guys. You don't. The I'd sanctity kill. of life. I'd kill who I would. Even the most deserving person. You wouldn't kill Hitler if the world depended on it? Personally, I wouldn't. I'd maybe get someone else to do it. You're, no, you have to do it or else it doesn't work. You have to strangle him with your bare hands. I couldn't have that on my conscience. Hitler? Anybody. Insane. You can't, you can't tell me you would choke Hitler to death. And then I'd feel good. I'd like pat myself on the back. I mean, it's a good thing to kill Hitler, but personally, you mm -hmm. grabbing his neck and choking the life out of him? Yeah, I could do it. Ugh! I couldn't do it. I could probably do it to you. Not I'm not strong enough. Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> okay, next question. Mm -hmm. On a scale of 1 to 10, how strict do you think mom and dad were when we were growing up? A lot stricter on us than they are on our brothers. Yeah, that's well, yeah. Dad's not strict anymore because he's dead. Wow. <laughs> we're ready. We're bringing you down <laughs> off that high of us. Okay. We had different parents than Connor and Caden had. Yeah. Connor and Caden can get away with anything right now. Yeah, it's insane. Connor and Caden are our younger brothers that are 19 and 17. Like Connor, we? Came, Connor came home the other day mm -hmm. at 5 in the morning, and Mom's like, where were you? And mm -hmm. he laughed, and that was the end of the conversation. <laughs> and if we were not home by midnight, we were grounded, <laughs> which is insane. That was, I think that was mostly Dad. Here's a fun story. Me and my husband now, <laughs> at the time my boyfriend, I was 16, I was not allowed to see him at all. Not allowed. Uh, for a whole year. Not allowed even a little bit. We snuck behind our parents' backs, doy, doy. <laughs> but yeah, for a whole year we weren't allowed to see each other, mm -hmm. and now we're married. So mm -hmm. suck on that, dad. Suck on it. Scoop me. <laughs> um. But also, like, they were a lot harder on you than they were on me. Mine, they were hard on me about my grades because I was a really bad student. They were hard on her because she was a little hussy. I was just not. <laughs> <laughs> they thought she was. Oh. I just had a boyfriend at 16 who wasn't a Mormon. And I didn't. We first... Was Cam your first boyfriend? Like, first real boyfriend? No. No? You don't really count all the other ones when you were in, like, Depends middle school. Depends on when you count. Like, do you count middle school... No. Relationships? No. Of course not. Then I kind of dated... I think I dated someone in high school. Hussy. The beginning of high school. Same little bit. And we, we broke up. Mm -hmm. And then started dating Cam. I oh. started dating Cam at the end of my, what year was that? My first year in high school. Sophomore. Yeah. Out here at sophomore year is your first year of high school. Ninth grade is middle school. And now we're married. Mm -hmm. And we have a baby. And we have a baby. Mm. I don't have a baby. They have a baby. Yeah, she's cute. And yeah, she's pretty freaking cute. Okay. Next question. I wonder if they can see me. Or if I'm You're probably fine. 
Um, nom, nom, nom. If you could time travel, what time would you go to? Huh. Hmm. Would I have to stay there? Or no, would I start like temporary? Just visit? Just visiting. Hmm. I'd like to see my childhood. Oh, dark. <laughs> Why? I, I just know. like. S I had. I had a great kid childhood. Yeah. Running around the park and mm -hmm. we, lived we lived right next to a Storm Mountain Park in Utah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And it was fun. It was fun. We had so many neighbor kids and mm -hmm. night we, games. We would all, yeah, it was just good it was times. Fun. It was a good childhood. Our, and we also used to play a lot of games. Like our family loves board games, probably because we were raised Mormon. Yeah. Classic Mormon. Our yeah. house was like the play, the the house to be at if you wanted to have fun. Exactly. But also, I think we were the neighbors that all the, like, classy neighbors hated. Because, <laughs> yeah. like, my brothers would run around in, like, pajama bottoms and no shirt on with, like, their underwear hanging out. Although, that's the family. We did yeah. have a neighbor kid poop in our backyard. So. That's true. Like, an adult man poop. And he was, like, what, five? <laughs> he was, like... I think he was older, and we were all, like... We were all horrified. I'm not judging it, and, we, like, we kept it there. It's just... It probably is still there. Petrified. <laughs> Um, okay, I would go to the Renaissance time because if you see, a must. if you see any portrait, Renaissance? listen, uh, there's a reason, uh, there's a reason. Gross. If you look at any painting of women back then, they all look like me. <laughs> <laughs> Big chubby women with curly <laughs> hair. I would be a goddess back then. <laughs> And that's what I would go for. I want people to love me and pamper me, even if it means I don't get to bathe. <laughs> <laughs> that's so gross. Yeah. I wouldn't stay for long because I would get nauseous from the noxious fumes coming off of everybody. Okay. <laughs> Did you know that the first ingredient in their honey sauce is high fructose corn syrup? That's why it's so good. And it, honey is their one, two, three, fourth ingredient. It's so good, though. We're here for a good time, not a long time. <laughs> okay. Wait, did I answer? Yeah, you would go back to your childhood. Oh, correct. Correct. <laughs> what personality trait has gotten you in the worst trouble? Probably your whorishness, right? Hope. <laughs> <laughs> what is yours? Um, my, I, I think, is it be, as in being annoying a personality trait? Yeah. So probably that then. I also laugh really loud sometimes. Which is obnoxious too. And that gets me in trouble with her the most. <laughs> um. I would say. Sometimes I say things. And they come out sounding not the way I intended them to say. <laughs> to sound. Like, as an example, <laughs> me and Courtney, like, my friends were her friends, mm -hmm. and her friends were my friends, mm -hmm. but for some reason, Courtney had a big beef about, these are my friends, not your friends. I don't think that's right. She did. Back in the day. I don't think so. Now, it's like, whatever, but when we were in, like, school, she would be like, these are my friends, not your friends. So, one day... Or one, we had a trip to uh, Brian Head, and we, I brought one of my friends, Corny brought one, a couple of her friends, and one of the aunts, one of our aunts asked something like, is he your friend? I was like, well, he's Courtney's friend. Oh, brother. <laughs> he's Courtney's friend, but he's also my friend. And he's like, that was rude. I was like, no, but, like, you're my friend. But you're yeah, you don't friend. think things through before you say them. <laughs> That's true. She's a real B-word sometimes. I don't know if I should swear. Probably yeah. not. Okay. Let's see. We do swear. <laughs> We're cool. But not on our YouTube channel. <laughs> okay. I'm freaking full. I know I am too. Comb my hair up. I should put her hair up. Oh! <gasps> Crazy. So if you like this, yeah, give us a give us a like. Yeah, come on, Aunt Kara. It's not that hard. <laughs> come on, Cam and Jared. Be supportive husbands. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. um, and um, next time, maybe, <laughs> we'll talk about... Um, we'll be more organized. Yeah. <laughs> we'll have something else to tell you, maybe uh -huh. about... Maybe some spooky things. Maybe, maybe some, some conspiracies. conspiracy theories. You know. So no. stick around for some interesting little tidbits here and there. And um, leave and a comment and tell me what... Answer some of the questions we ask. Or tell us which one's more annoying. You know. Do you like burping? Do you ah. hate us? Let us know. Um, maybe don't let us know if you hate us. I got a pretty fragile ego. Is your name Katie? <laughs> Just, if you like us, let us know. If you don't, also let us know. Thanks for watching. Yeah, we'll see you uh, next time. Yep. Bye. Bye. <laughs>